Come on, wake it up, wake it up, boy. You already know. It's diesel talk, you feel me? Hey, straight up. Always back into it. Always doing the breakdown. Hey, because the breakdown is needed, man. If you don't do a breakdown or something and pay attention to close detail, you're going to be lacking. You're going to be missing. It's always something you got to catch within something. Always remember that. You feel me? Hey, you know, we got C-Mac right here, man. We going in about him right now and Christopher Lovejoy. You know what I'm saying? We know his old manager. You know what I'm saying? Trainer. All the, you know, that type of shit. What's really going on? No. Before we even dive off into it like this, it's always some shit going down, you know what I'm saying, with bad black business. So who's, whose fault is it? Is it C-Max or is it Lovejoy? Because, I mean, we're going to listen to this video, this little short video, and see what C-Max is saying and see how he's talking. Straight up. We got to dissect this shit because shit like this needs to stop because we all got business to do. We all got business to. And it's like the black man, black man can't even do business far with each other beside, before it just goes it gets fucked up. Boop. That's some bullshit happening in the terms of bombing. Look at go. But I'm smart the wise man. Mr. Lovejoy was playing the management position. That wasn't cut position. Cut has a man. He has a grown man. A man, a grown man. A far, 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 far. Up in places, five. Where you gotta see five. A real destruction, five, go. On the hood that has connections with everything that's going on with my issue with everything. Mr. Lovejoy is really a great man. People deal with Mr. Lovejoy on. Okay, but listen though. Once again though, last time we really seen them together was when they was boxing. So it's like what what transpired? People were saying he got the he got the a uh, uh, channel, but if you look at if you look at Lovejoy's channel. Shit, he, he's doing content on his own channel. He's not using the old C-Mac channel that had like 200 and some hundred, almost 300,000 subscribers. Feel me? I don't know what's going on, but how they fall out? How did C-Mac got people talking about his uncle? It's like he need to, I mean, they're talking about like his uncle, his uncle out there, his dad, all this, all this information. It's time to it's in the bud. It's like, man, every time the man is doing business with somebody or getting involved, it's always like a bad, it's always like a bad trail. Is it C-Mac or what? Or is it the other people? Y'all like and subscribe to this shit, man. Talk about this shit in the comments. Let me know how y'all feel what's really going on. The coxing shit on the hood. As far as men, because I'm a manager on the hood, he was trying to play a part. But the man, his man, his boy, far, 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 far out. Where you gotta do destruction by going So wait, so now what I'm hearing C-Mac is saying out of his own mouth is that the management, right? He wasn't, he, he, Lovejoy's not, not good at this. He was just trying to play a part that he's, that he has no expertise in. You feel me? So now if this is going on, why was C-Mac claiming him as his manager then? This is what I'm saying. Blood, this is some vomity ass shit. No, we got to get down to the bottom of it. Come on, we thought C-Mac was getting out, fresh out. You know what I'm saying? Like he would start thinking smarter. It's like, damn, now you ain't fucking with the nigga. Why is you not fucking with him for one? And then if he was your manager, you was calling your manager once upon a time. But now he, he don't have the skills to be one. That type of shit on the hood has connections with everything going on. It's not rocket science, girl. You motherfuckers understand what I'm saying. Because you think, honestly, I would like to have all my information and in my face every day when I see girl. And I lost punching the shit out of girl in that toxic fight. Oh, nigga, we that kill us, oh, no, no, no. Come on, talking about where they was sparring. Basically, like, nigga, I put hands on you, nigga, when we was fighting. So, see, see, Mac, <laughs> see, Mac be taking it there. You know what I'm saying? And, and, and Love Joy, he just be, you know, he be calm and collective, man. He be calm and collective. You feel me? He don't get out of character. Motherfucker can say that. He don't get out of character. So, we about to see what's going on. Cause I fuck with, I fuck with both of them. I fuck with both of them. But when you, when you, you just trying to dissect some shit and break it down, you know what I'm saying? So you're trying to get down to, because this type of shit helps you for when you further your business. Cause you might run into individuals like both of these dudes. Ain't gotta sit here and say which one is right, which one is wrong. See what I'm saying? You gotta pay attention to detail. Don't tell me hard in that Y'all know. Something bigger and bigger and bigger and bigger. Oh, that's just bigger. 
all of us just, and that's exactly what it is. It's a man, another man, another man, another man. What's he talking and about? Another man, far, 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 far up by a place where you do destruction. On these smith right ass cities and these enemies on the hood, where you do serious shit. A far, 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 which they, where they put y'all on the hood. Where they put y'all, what is he Mr. talking Hood's about? Hood. You is hood, hood. Continue to do your coxing and live your life, cub. Damn, he said, and live your life. Man, we trying to see what's going on, because that right there, hold on. That right there. And I'm gonna keep it there. That was like, hold on, hold on. We gotta, we gotta go back to some, man. Cause I seen some earlier. I seen some earlier. You know, it's deep talk, so we breaking this shit down. I seen some earlier, man, where where motherfucking C Mac said something else, and it was short, a clip. You feel me? Let me clear this out. Yeah, I seen some earlier. Yeah, let me just go to Crip Map, cause I seen some earlier. And it was, I seen some earlier, and he was just like, damn, we got to see what's going on. There's a left joint right there, and he had said something, and it was like, what? I don't know if y'all can find it right now. But I'm going to find it. It was real short, but he was basically saying, he was saying the man scammed him. He was saying the man scammed me. He was saying the man scammed me, man. And, it, and it's, it's a new video, so, you know, we just trying to get down to the bottom of this type of shit, man. It's Diesel talk, you know what I'm saying? You gotta wake your game up, you know what I'm saying? Cause we on the internet. We on the internet, you know what I'm saying? So remember, it's how you move. You feel me? We getting older. You gotta open up your motherfucking brain cells and you get to the maximum capacity. You know what I'm saying? Through all your little business transactions. So you don't have no shit like this going. You feel me? If somebody's right, if somebody's wrong. Always remember that. In order to move forward, you got to know that. It's diesel talk, boy. I'm gone.